Yeah, yeah, they're in there. So those are the guys that didn't get a chance to get in there with the queen. So what she does is she kind of calls them so they'll stick onto whatever platform, whatever it is, so they're able to get in. But we usually um, have a hole for them to go in and out, but not, not, during, uh, not during transportation. Uh, we don't sometimes we're on 95 and even though we don't have the holes on them they can still come out of a little bit and there's people calling our numbers in the back of the truck saying hey you have bees you have bees in the back of your truck <laughs> yeah it does say bee boys <laughs> so uh this is not a pesticide and it's a green solution. Now we don't use any pesticides. Yeah. We're not a pesticide company, but this is uh, some products that we've used determined in years and years of what they don't like. So what, she was already building cones. You have a nice white cone there that I'm gonna leave because I want them to come back to that. I want them to come back to this area so they know that the queen is gone. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, they're, they're, they're very smart. They are super smart. Excellent builders. And a lot of people, you know, in America, they're not, they don't really know too much about the bees right now. They're learning a little bit more because of education. We do a lot of education in schools and stuff like that for the fire department and the cities and stuff that tend to get. Huh? Yeah, she's about two centimeters bigger than these guys. So she's a nice size. You can spot her. She's. Um, they try to 
try to hide her, but you you got to look very carefully. Once uh, once once we get to our relocation system, we put a color on her, so it's easier for us to detect her. Cause sometimes it's hard, cause they'll try to hide her and and then they yeah. <laughs>